One health is about um, recognizing that the health of uh, humans is dependent or is closely linked to that of the of animals and the environment where they, they, they interact. And gender is the roles or the norms associated with being a man, a woman, a girl or a boy. So there are a few examples where gender is, is important, for example, in uh, exposure to diseases. For example, where women are um, in the kitchen uh, cooking and maybe they are expected to slaughter, for example, chicken and exposed to uh, pathogens that are likely in uh, chicken meat, for example, Campylobacter and Salmonella, among others. The other one is uh, recognizing that uh, women are more prone to certain diseases. We saw in the case of um, listeriosis, for example, in South Africa, where a uh, majority of those that were affected were, were women. The other thing is the role of gender in targeting interventions. Incorporating gender in one health just makes it easier for countries to achieve health, but also to meet uh, several of other uh, sustainable de development goals. The Hill project, um, which here is, is, is one of the partners. So this project operates in Ethiopia, Kenya, and Somalia, and it involves uh, professionals from the um, health domain, uh, animals, uh, and environment, working together with the uh, local pastoral communities. So this project operates through what they call uh, One Health Units, and through these units, the community is actively engaged. So the needs that they have are captured, well captured. Jeddah is strongly part of it. Uh, tools like, for example, the training manuals, the setting of time for meetings and interaction, interactions during these one health units. It considers the gender. One investment is, of course, uh, research evidence generation. We need more data, for example, the, the, the gender segregated data, to, to begin to understand what are some of the, 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 these factors that um, would uh, warrant further, further work to, to, to bring out the gender element in interventions. The other one is um, trying to see which roles are these uh, are being defined by gender, and how do those roles for example, increase or decrease the risk of exposure, for example, to important uh, zoonotic diseases. And also, what are some of the factors that will lim limit women's uh, participation or women's contribution in ensuring that their health is good, the health of their families and communities is good, and also the health of the animals that support their livelihoods and that of the, the environment is, is well taken care of. So the other one is making sure that um, gender is captured during the project life cycle. Uh, these, these, ideas, these ideas of thinking about gender can only come clear if you include gender um, specialists in these, uh, in, these, uh, in these projects. And one important thing is ensuring that there is budget to, 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 to have gender considered in the project.